We touched on this last time we talked, but I thought it was really interesting. So if, you know, someone might say, yeah, I have high blood pressure, but if I get that pill, my blood pressure is normal. So I'm okay. So what's wrong with that? Uh, well, what's wrong with it is that you're not okay. You just have uh, a drug induced blood pressure number. So you could say I'm in a really bad mood. If I snort cocaine or if I inject heroin, I'm calm. True. So are you better or are you just drug induced? So what we know is, for instance, two people applying for life insurance and they have, they're genetically identical twins and they have all the same numbers. Do they pay the same? Not, not if one's on, on pills. If one's taking, if one, if both have 120 over 80 blood pressure, but one's taking medication, that one pays more. Why? Because everybody on earth knows that taking medication doesn't make you healthy and that you, you are at much greater risk of future illness and costing insurance companies more money and a greater risk of death if you have drug induced normal blood pressure or cholesterol or blood sugar than if you have lifestyle induced normal. Mm -hmm. And so every, the people know, they just don't think there's any other option because mm -hmm. they don't understand that it's lifestyle.